There are times Can you pop? where we all need a helping hand. Yes. But sometimes Good boy. it's a paw. Stay. Ashley McMeans found hers in shelter dogs like Ralph, a staff sergeant in the Air Force. When she came back from deployment, McMeans suffered from PTSD. Right. It was very stressful. The transition is really hard. The outside is really different. <laughs> Feeling lost, she joined Heroes and Hounds, a program at the Humane Society of East Tennessee. I was really withdrawn, and I was very sad, and I was very lonely, but this has really brought me to a better place. And it's proven to be a really successful program. Veterans have a chance to train dogs that might not find homes otherwise. And it calms them down a little bit. It gives them more focus. And the veterans love it. They absolutely love it. They love being with the dog. Um, I think it kind of calms them a little bit. Maybe they lack confidence too, but I can relate to that. So it's easier to have patience with them when you see yourself in one of these dogs. The vets teach the dogs to sit, stay, all the basics, while learning something themselves about transitioning back to civilian life. When you're in a battle by yourself, it's really hard. But now I have friends and I have furry friends to kind of help cheer me up when I'm down and... I think that that's a really important component is being a part of something and serving again. Sure, it's hard when they leave, even if that was the goal all along. Come here, buddy. But by getting Ralph ready for his new home, McMeans found hers right here. I've made more family members, yes. In Knoxville. Oh, yeah, he sits now. Michael Crow, 10 News.